And just how difficult is it to step in in that situation like Ryan Lamar, a guy that hasn't been up here very long and come through and produce for you? Well, he's got experience and he's a pro, man. He, he is he's thrilled to be here. Um, you know, his work is terrific. He's prepared for for, you know, all kinds of situations. Obviously, that was a situation, you know, if if Glaber got him over, we we're going to we we're going to hit him there. He was he was ready for that for you know, preparing for that for over an inning probably. Um, and, you know, I love the aggression. You know, it's like, you know what you're looking for. I don't want to get the ball in the air. You know, using the entire field, got to pitch up and out over the plate that he could uh, get in the air. And it's just a really pro job of hitting right there in that spot. Just how grateful do you feel to get out of here with the win, considering the way that things unraveled late for your bullpen? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I mean, that, that's huge. Uh, you know, we're, look, we're up against it in a lot of ways today. You know, you know, Woj gave us four strong innings, you know, and even he's not totally built up, probably went longer with him. And then, you know, having some guys obviously down, down there and relying on other guys to step up, you know, Britt and Chappie have worked a lot lately, probably a little bit on fumes out there um, tonight, but just kind of gutting through it. And, um, you know, a tough, hard win, and again, a lot of people contributing. You now head to Boston to face your rival Red Sox again. Just having this much momentum going into this series, what can that do for you guys? Well, I think the guys are certainly, you know, feel good that they're playing well um, and playing with confidence and, and relishing in, in si different situations that come up in the game. And uh, you know, going out there and executing when it matters. So we got to continue that. We obviously we we know we know what Boston is and how good they are, and hopefully we can go uh, you know put our best foot forward starting tomorrow with Monty. Zach Braziller, you have the next question. Oh, Aaron, was, was Chad Green unavailable? Was Chad Green unavailable? Yes. yes. What? Um, he what he so he only threw thirteen pitches. Was there any any reason? Yeah, for he threw why? he threw thirty two days before that. So he's thrown you know over forty pitches in in yeah three days. So Greeny was down today. I, I wanted to avoid Greeny last night, um, you know, just because you know he's been a, it's been a little heavy for him lately. So um, yeah, he was definitely down tonight. Andy Martino, you have the next question. Uh, what did you see from Wilson tonight, Aaron? Uh, kind of building on, frankly, his last couple outings where he's actually, you know, he gave up a home run in his last outing. The time before that, I think he gave up a run as well. But it was it's a different guy. It's a different guy than what we saw before. The life is there on the fastball. Um, I thought he used the cutter really well today, um, you know, to set up the fastball that has that Willie life to it again. And, you know, he picked us up big time today, you know, going four outs for us. Uh, at a key point in the game, uh, you know, we know what he's capable of and, and know what a big role he can play for us. So it was good to see him. I know he's been feeling better um, about the way, way he feels and how he's throwing the ball and to go out and get some really good results, um, you know, hopefully is another big step for him. Go back to Meredith. Aaron, you mentioned Chapman probably running on fumes a little bit, but it looked like he kept looking at his hand. What's going on with his yeah, hand? Yeah, the nail again, be, you know, became an issue for him. But, you know, obviously he was able to grind through it and, you know, finished off uh, Miller really strong there. So another strong outing for Chappie. What's the level of concern that that's going to be a problem moving forward? You know, usually it's something that pops up a little randomly and, and you know, we get it taken care of pretty well. I expect that to be the case again, um, but we'll just see and continue to monitor it, obviously. Uh, Tom Merriam, please unmute. Aaron, on this road trip you're about to take, have you seen one that's important in the middle of the season throughout your career? Probably, um, you know, but there's, th th there's no denying the importance of it. You know, um, it's a tough road trip. Um, you know, we're playing good baseball. Uh, but we understand the importance of and the urgency of every day, especially this time of the year. And, and obviously, uh, but we look forward to that challenge of going to play some really good teams on the road. Go to Randy Miller. 
Aaron, you talk a lot about not letting uh, mistakes in the field affect you. Uh, Labor has that air there, yeah. uh, kind of open the floodgates, and then he comes in and gets a bunt down. And that's something that you guys don't do a lot, and you got it down, and that led to the run. Yeah, you, you know, talk all the time. You got to keep playing. The next play is too important. And, you know, you can't wallow in mistakes um, it, because they're going to happen. They're going to they're gonna happen over the course of the season, over the course of a game, and, and you got to just continue to move on, learn from everything, but but move on. And, uh, yeah, I thought that was a good job by Glaber there. And, you know, a good job of, you know, you know, taking his shot with it, one strike. He wanted one strike and then, um, you know, not something that Glaber's done much of, a, probably not at all in his career and, you know, executed perfectly there in that situation.